What's going on YouTube? It's Chris back again and this time we have another pod review. This here is the Ahi Mango grown by Eeyores Truly. Now you may notice on the end it's a little green and you'll also notice these two spots on this side and on this side because this plant was in a five gallon bucket and this pepper hung about right at the edge of the lip of the bucket so it was either hanging on it like that or it was like that we've been having some pretty strong winds and expected to get a storm or two soon so i thought why not just go ahead and pick it and a little bit of green at the bottom doesn't bother me i'm gonna take this um i'm gonna save some seeds out of it because i like the way they look and apparently the flavor is awesome we're gonna find out. Another uh, another person that's really excited about this is Dave. We've been uh, chatting back and forth in regards to this specific pepper. <laughs> it's uh, one of his most anticipated of the season. Let's see if I don't cut my finger off here. Fruity-ish. Hmm. Can't really... I don't really have much of a smell. There's the inside. See, I guess some of the seeds were damaged by the constant pressure on those two points but anywho we're gonna take some seeds out Get out of there come on go And let these dry for, oh, I don't know, five, six, seven days. I can't remember. What's well, good practice is I like to uh, take a piece of the pot out with it <clears throat> when I take seeds out and leave that piece of the pot on the paper towel or however you're drying the seeds. And whenever the, uh, piece of the pod gets dry then you're pretty sure fire that you're gonna be okay with your seeds being dry that's just the way I see it it's my thinking on it uh, after some research I found that this pod should be well this variety usually hangs in at around 30,000 to 50,000 scoville heat units. So we'll see. I don't know which one. Both sides, one side. We'll go for it. All of it. No. Take a bite from the money and tell you what I think about it. <clears throat> so here it is Ahi Mango. You know, to be exactly really super fresh off the plant like just picked it before I started this video 
It's kind of chewy. I don't know if it's got something to do with the walls being kind of thin on it. But really citrusy up front. Like, um, I won't say like orange citrusy. It's more like a like an acidic kind of lemon kind of taste. But it's good. Right now it's hitting me with an all over the mouth burn. All over. And slowly, I guess where I swallowed it, it's working its way to the back of my tongue. And the throat. <clears throat> so far, I mean, it's 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 not so violent. It's uh it's what I would call a steady burn. I can't really feel it climbing any. I think this is uh I think this is gonna be it. Oh, seed, sorry. Excuse me. <clears throat> and now the burn's moved to under my tongue. It's hit the tongue the entire time. Um, it's not in the gums, not in the roof of the mouth. Straight on the lips and on the tongue. <clears throat> this um i don't like most people would think it it being a quote-unquote milder variety it's a uh, i'm thinking it would be a great base for a sauce and uh i've discussed it with a couple people and they think the same thing like hey if you ever do it let's try it like i'm excited but I'm thinking, these pods, with some mangoes, you know, I don't care to give my ideas out because I'm not going to market anything. If anything, <clears throat> if anything, I'll just give it away mainly. But yeah, some mangoes with with the ahi mango, yeah. So maybe <clears throat> maybe a really sweet sauce. Um, more on the sugary side, I think. But I don't know. I never made a hot sauce. Never, uh, never really gotten into that. Not yet, anyways. Um, but as far as the heat from this pod, it's pretty much subsided. I've still got some resonating around my mouth. I mean, it's not, it's not gonna quote unquote make you eat dirt or anything. <laughs> it's, uh, I don't anticipate it to be a belly bomb either. I think, uh, I think, uh, most people would enjoy this. It's a perfect entry level pod if you want to start eating fresh pods to uh, the hotter side. To me, I mean, it's it's a little bit above a jalapeno. <coughs> it's not quite on that precipice of habanero level yet, but it's there. I mean, it's a it's a noticeable heat, and I think a lot of people would like this. Well, guys. I'm gonna finally eat breakfast. <laughs> I hope everyone has a great evening or whatever time you're watching this. Always remember if you want to see anything, hear anything, or anything I can do for you, throw it down in the comments. Uh, hit me up on Google Hangouts, Facebook. I've got my Snapchat, my Facebook, my Google Plus linked in the description as always. Um, if for some reason I forget it in this video, go back to another video. I'm sure you'll find it. It's in every one. But until next time, guys.